What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for checking out this video. Today we're going to be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism Palette, which is a trio to the Modern Renaissance and Subculture Palette. Um, please be sure to follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Nani Beauty. And be sure, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and be sure to hit that bell to get all notifications from new uploaded videos. And if you want to see how I created this look, then just keep watching. Alright, so I just got the box. I haven't opened the actual palette yet. This will be the first time. So we're just going to go ahead and open it and jump right in. Alright, so on the inside of the box, there is a little paper. Basically, disclaimers, cautions, boring stuff. Okay, so here we have the Prism palette. The outside, oh, and I've already stained it. Awesome. Okay, so the outside feels um, exactly the same as the previous palette, the Modern Renaissance and the Subculture. Um, it has the fuzzy texture. So we're gonna swatch a matte and metallic and see how those swatch on the hand and then we'll go ahead and create a look with it. So first I'm gonna go into Lear. Okay, so this is it on the finger and we're just gonna go ahead and swatch it here. So very high pigment, it did go on really smooth. I really like the color Throne here. So I'm gonna go on with that. I'm just gonna go and swatch next to it. And that is thrown extremely pretty. So, so pretty. Okay, very, very shimmery. So focus, very, very shimmery. I'm actually curious how Lucid is going to swatch. So, um, so we're just gonna go ahead and swatch that one. Let's swatch it here. See if it'll focus. So that, that one, that one is also really pretty, very shimmery. And I think we're going to swatch one more matte and then we'll get into the eye look. So I'm going to swatch Sphere because it is a very neon and bright yellow. I'm going to see what the payoff is. Very smooth as I'm like going into it. And this is Sphere. Okay, so that's the four swatches. Again, we have Lure. We have Throne. We have um, Lucid. And we have Okay, now let's get into the eye look. So I'm going to start out by going in with Unity, which is this one right here, and using that one to warm up the crease a little bit. So I'm actually going to be using the brush that came inside the palette and see how this one works. Okay, so personally I feel like this brush is a little bit, the bristles are a little bit too hard for me to be able to um, blend out and for it to be comfortable so I'm just going to switch back to one of my other brushes okay so that unity is in there I'm going to go in with Saturn which is this kind of corally color and I'll put that one in the crease as well alright so Saturn blends it out really easy um, it's really comfortable really smooth to go on all right so i'm just gonna go in with dimension which is this metallic shade here i'm gonna first apply it with no setting spray and see how the pigmentation is okay so i'm gonna zoom you guys in a little bit okay so there definitely is some payoff but it's not as pigmented as i would like so i'm gonna go ahead and spray it with some setting spray and see if it helps Alright, so that definitely helps the payoff. Um, looks so much better. I'm gonna zoom you guys back out. I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that out. Okay, so now that dimension is on the outer corners, I'm gonna go in with Sphere. That neon yellow. I'm gonna put that one in the center. Okay, so now that Sphere is on, I really do like um, the payoff of it, I love the color of it. So I'm going to go in with Eternal, which is the one that was like adorned in the subculture. This one right here. I'm just going to pop that one in the lower lash line. And for mascara, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Troublemaker Mascara. And for lashes, I'm going to be going in with this brand called Iris in the style Athena. And um, Iris is a cruelty-free brand, so they're okay to use. And I'm going to be using their glue that's called My Glue Thing. Okay, 
And I'm gonna go in with this Tarte lip paint in the color Birthday Suit. So this is the final look using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism Palette. If you guys liked it, please be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. Also be sure to hit that bell so you get all the notifications when any new videos are uploaded. Um, don't forget to follow me on Facebook and Instagram at Nani Lee Beauty. And thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Bye!